All right, guys, so today on the veteran's point of view, I'm going to be answering the 36 questions women have for men. How does it feel to be the same sex as Donald Trump? Well, I don't know. How does that feel to be the same sex as Casey Anthony? Why do you hate rom-coms? Or do you just feel like you need to hate them? Everybody likes The Notebook. Everybody likes Beyonce. Okay, first of all, I have no idea what rom-coms are. Second of all, I don't like The Notebook. Like, a lot of women don't like Marvel The Avengers. And not even just women. And plus, not everybody likes Beyonce as not everybody likes Green Day like I do. It's just a fact. Why do you make women sit around and talk about men in movies when y'all easily just sit around and talk about boobs for hours? Okay, first of all, never made women sit and talk about guys on movies. And the other thing is, I don't know anybody who actually can sit for hours talking about boobs. Why do you automatically assume that you won't like TV or movies that star a female lead? Why? Are you crazy? Have you watched Wonder Woman? Are you surprised when women are funny? I'm probably funnier than you. No, I actually don't care if a woman is funny. I love a lot of female comedians, but and no, no, you are definitely not funny. Why do you think that we're obsessed with you when we hook up? Nine times out of ten, I just want you to leave too. I'm busy. I got shit to do. Trust me, men are not that obsessed. Uh, your women are the ones that text every five seconds right after a date. And if the guy don't answer right away, you go freaking insane. Why can't I sleep with as many people as I want to without being judged? When men do it, they're congratulated. Why uh, no, actually, guys don't congratulate each other on how many girls they slept with, maybe if during high school. And second of all, you want to sleep with guys, you just need to find a guy who will like your freaking snakes. Why do you consider a woman a tease if she doesn't sleep with you after three dates, but a slut if she sleeps with you on the first date? And I don't know, maybe because guys are pretty direct in how they feel and what they want from a relationship, and women just like to play around most of the time. In what world does no mean yes? No means no. We all know no means no, or no means no, try again later. Why do you say that women are too emotional to be leaders? Then justify catcalling by saying men just can't control themselves. Actually, I don't think nowadays most people have issues with women being leaders. And second issue, catcalling. Well, catcalling actually first for whistling and things like that. And women nowadays say catcalling as if a guy comes up to Dan and tries to say hi. And I'm sorry, but there's no way a guy gonna get to know a female if he doesn't approach her and try to say something. Why do you think that just because you're nice to me, I owe you my body? Why Actually, trust me, I don't think anybody wants your body. Why would you ever send an unsolicited dick pic? Uh, yeah, no. Why do you feel like it's okay to harass women or make offensive comments about women, but when somebody does it to your sister, it's not okay. All right, all right. I just want to say this, all right? So, by females I know, women are much worse on talk about people behind their backs than guys. All right, so how does it feel when you get about guys if someone did that to your little brother? How does it feel to interrupt me when I'm in the middle of making a point during a meeting? Women interrupt men about a hundred times more than guys actually interrupt women. Most of the times that guys interrupt women, it's because they take like a 10 second pause and the guys just think they're done talking. Why do you have to sit with your legs so wide open? I get that you have balls, but I don't stand around with my arms wide open to make room for my boobs. Okay, I don't know if you know how to use a measure tape, but try to measure the space you have between your legs and the space you have between your arms. Okay, there's a huge freaking difference. And also stop taking extra sits to put your bags on, alright? 
Why are women perceived as the weaker sex? Even though we literally birth you. Like watermelons through like this. Why? All right, by the way, physical strength and tolerance to pain are two complete different things. And I really don't know many guys who will not actually applaud women for passing through all the pain to give birth to a child. It's so bad to show your emotions. It means you're human. Uh, maybe because every time a man shows their emotions, women make fun and send memes like drinking from a cup of man tears. Why are you always trying to prove your masculinity to me? And why do you seem to be trying to prove how feminist you are? Why the f*** isn't it lady like to cuss? When did words get gendered? So, okay, I I'll just say this. I don't give a f*** if you curse. Actually, guys have the same problems with women cursing than men cursing. If someone's sitting by me and every second word is a curse word, I will get annoyed and I don't give a flying fuck if that's a guy or a woman. Why is it your first instinct to doubt women who have been sexually violated or raped? Why? Uh, it may have to do with a lot of women that say they have been raped and destroy someone's life later on. It's proven that nothing actually happened. And besides, in a court of law, you are innocent until proved guilty. And it's not just about rape. If someone says they were robbed or that someone stole something from someone, I'll doubt until I have proof. Do you assume a woman's angry because she's on her period? What? All right, for that, I'm gonna let professionals explain. Is this whole concept of period rage or extreme PMS, is that something you, I mean, you, you see? see this? So I, I haven't met that lady. <laughs> um, but in general, yes, walked in your it, no, in general, they're talking about premenstrual dysphoric disorder, which impacts approximately two to 8% of women of childbearing age. So just think about premenstrual syn syndrome, PMS, but kick that up about 100 notches and that will land you at PMDD, PMN premenstrual dysphoric disorder. Why do you think women that wear makeup are false advertising? We can say the same thing about your dick size. And you guys do. Why isn't it weird that there's a bunch of old white men sitting in a room making legislation about what I can and can't do with my body? Okay, first of all, you're being racist as fuck. Second of all, you guys, females vote too. So you're also the fault why you have the so-called white man making those decisions for you. Maybe you should learn how to vote better. Do you have a coochie? Uh, no, do you have a dick? Why are straight guys so obsessed with lesbians? Actually, it's been proven for a long, long time that females look more at lesbian porn than guys. How does it feel to get kicked in the ball? Well, I don't know. How does that feel to be punched in the tits? Do you ever get tired of trying to be manly all the time? Uh, actually, no, it, and it may have to do with me being a man. And by the way, you're doing a great job looking manly. Why are you so afraid of gender equality? Actually, I have no problem with equality. And by the way, females in the most in the United States have more rights than men. Why do I deserve to be paid less than you? In what world does 77 cents equal a dollar? In what world does 68 cents equal a dollar? How is that fair? Actually, you know, the, the truth about that is that I have no knowledge of every single country's exchange rate to be able to tell you which country is 68 cents equal to a dollar or which country is 75 cents equal to a dollar. Why are you intimidated by a woman who makes more money than you? That's awesome! First of all, you just complain saying that women don't make as much money as men and second of all, you make a lot of money? Great, let's work for me. More money! Why are opinionated women seen as bitches? When opinionated men are seen as bosses. Actually, I have no problems with opinionated women or men. A lot of times have to do on how the person delivers their opinion. If you try to pass your opinion to me as forceful as you can, I don't give a damn if you're a man or a woman. You're a bitch. Why aren't you speaking up when you hear your male friends behind closed doors make jokes that are offensive to women? 
You know, the interesting thing is that you say you're the funny one, and women make a lot of fun of men too. So that's your equal to you right there. But the truth is that most guys don't go making fun of women or jokes actually women related. Why are you so afraid of recognizing your own privilege? Doesn't mean you're a bad person. Just recognize it and do something about it. Actually, as I said before, women in legislation have more rights than men. And during a divorce, 90 times out of 100, women actually get the child and they get paid alimony. Doesn't matter what they did. All right, guys, so tell the truth. Um, that was fun, and you may agree or not with my points of view, um, but if you don't, you may be the, what is wrong with the world today. Um, the only thing I can say is, give a like if you like the video, hit the subscribe button, hit the notifications bell, and every week I'm going to come up with a new topic on a veteran's opinion. And I'll see you guys next week. Thank you.